Have you ever thought about it? Why people are opting for robot partners? There are so many reasons, you know, in our relationship, uh, humans are always uh, uh, not only vulnerable in many fields. And Shakespeare wrote, frailty, thy name is woman. I don't uh, agree with that point always, but what I think is there are so many reasons and one of the key reasons is humans are unpredictable. However, the robot partners are absolutely predictable. Before we proceed, let me tell you one thing. If you have not subscribed yet, please subscribe. It means a lot to me. And if you have already subscribed, lots of thanks for your support. Printable from uh, considering any angle, I mean, from hardware, from software, from algorithms, how they are made. And in this video, I would like to just tell you something about the robot's skeleton. I mean, robot skeleton is something that uh, should match uh, of another human partner. That, uh, that means we heard about all his uh, body types, like someone has athletic body type, someone uh, is uh, a little bit fat, a little bit thin, agile, someone doesn't like to move very fast. However, in and as long as you think about having a robot partner to have some fun, have some great time, uh, that is whether that is in your uh, in your room, in your garden, in your uh, anywhere else. In that case, in that case, you must have something that can withstand your all types of pressure because you are supposed to apply pressure, apply force. As long as physical activity is concerned, and what I think is that there are several options open for uh, the robots, like for robot skeleton, like it can be made made by uh, steel, it can be made by aluminium uh, alloys, or also it can be made by carbon fiber, which is of course one of the latest technology. And uh, carbon fiber reinforcement reinforced polymers, that means we also call it CFRPS. That is also, or simply carbon fiber, uh, is one of the greatest choice. Why it is one of the greatest choices? Because it can not only it can uh, match the agility, strength, efficiency of a human. That is the one of the biggest point uh, advantage. It is one of the, but at the same time, but at the same time, uh, there are some unmatched strength, uh, high stiffness, design freedom, vibration damping, excellent. Uh, fatigue and corrosion resistance and some disadvantages also that means it is highly highly uh, very very costly because uh, the raw materials and the complex labor intensive manufacturing processes like autoclave uh, curing i will talk about these things later of course in my future videos this altogether they make carbon fiber components significantly more expensive than their metal counterparts, that means steel or uh, aluminium alloy. And there are some manufacturing complexities also there. And uh, complex damage assessment and repair that is, uh, look, in a crack in a metal, metal part is usually visible, right. In a composite carbon fiber, a damage from an impact can occur between the layers, okay. So, uh, with no visible sign on the surface, but there is a fracture, there is a, uh, uh, there is some uh, crack inside it, but it is not visible on the, far, on the surface. So, it makes difficult to detect. And suddenly, when you are having some good time with your robot partner, suddenly it breaks down. That is not desirable for any uh, robot partners, at least modern robot partners, which are, uh, of course,
course, uh, are built with uh, agility, strength that can match any other human beings. Moreover, moreover, on top of these things, uh, there is a promise of uh, super intelligence, which is knocking our door. And hopefully it will, uh, in five years or 10 years, it will come and make these human robots more uh, smart, that means even smarter than us. And I don't know whether uh, in that time you will also opt for uh, human robots because they will be smarter than you in that case. So uh, the relation, the future of uh, human relationship is is in a, in in a very volatile state at present, and there could be uh, more disruptions uh, disruptions that we can expect in the future. So let's see how it uh, goes on, how it progresses. However, still the question remains why people prefer human robot partners more than human partners and how we can overcome this dilemma. Let's see what happens. So that is it. Thank you for joining us on this journey. Let's continue this conversation in the comments below. If you like the video, please hit the bell icon to get notified and don't forget to like with your friends, share and subscribe for more insights. If you have already subscribed, tons of thanks for your support. It means a lot to me. And please consider signing up for membership zone to support wooden slate so that we can make it better and better. See you in the next video. Till then, goodbye. Take care and stay safe.